Welcome back to the official Zap Hosting YouTube channel. My name is Ellie, and in today's tutorial, I will show you how to set up a Sons of the Forest server on your Windows VPS. So let's get started. First, I will show you how to get a Windows VPS server. If you own one already, skip the video to the provided timestamp on the screen. Now navigate to the root server bar, select VPS Hosting and then click on Windows VPS Hosting. Here you can configure a server to your liking. You can change the server location, RAM, CPU cores, disk space, IP addresses, bandwidth and the operating system. Finally, select a payment method and confirm your order. But before you do that, here is a little gift from us. 50% off voucher code, which you can use by clicking here on use voucher and typing VPS minus sons. After you confirm your order, the server will be up in just a minute. Now click on your VPS server and wait for the server to finish the installation. Once the installation completes, navigate to the settings tab which can be found right here on the left. Here create an administrator password that you will have to use in order to log in via the remote desktop app. After creating a password, click on save. Now copy your service IP and launch the remote desktop app on your PC. Click on show options. In the logon setting tab, paste in the IP of your server. The username will always be administrator by default. Now click connect and type the password which is the one you defined earlier and click OK. After successfully connecting to the machine, create a folder on your desktop and name it however you like. For example, I will call it Sons of the Forest Server. Now open Google Chrome and paste in the link that you will find in the video description. Here scroll down until you find the download link and click on download. Now open File Explorer, go to the Downloads folder, open the Steam file that you just downloaded and drag and drop the contents into the folder you created earlier. After that, double click Steam CMD and wait for the installation to finish. After it is finished, write down the following command, login anonymous. Then paste in the command that you will find in the video description. Installation of your Sons of the Forest dedicated server will now begin, which can take up to 5 minutes, so sit back and relax. After successful installation, feel free to close this window. Now open the folder you created earlier. Here you will find a bunch of new files. Go to Steam Apps, Common, then Sons of the Forest dedicated server. Here you will find the files of your Sons of the Forest server. You will now need to create default config files by simply launching a server by clicking on the Start Sons of the Forest dedicated bat file. After you see the message to restart your server, simply close this window and navigate back to your file explorer. Click on View, then check the box where it says Hidden Items. After that, navigate to this PC, then local disk, click on users, then administrator. After that, app data, then local low. Click on add night, then sons of the forest DS. Here you can find your config file, so right click on it and then click on edit with notepad++. Here you can edit settings like server name, player account, password and many other settings. But after configuring everything to your liking, save the file and close the window. You will now need to unlock the ports in the firewall before starting the server. Open the search bar, search for Windows Defender Firewall with advanced security and click on it. Navigate to inbound rules, click on new rule, click on port and then next. Here select UDP and write the exact numbers as me, 87662701697002700. and click on next. Make sure allow the connection is selected, here all the boxes must be checked, in this field create whatever name you like and click on finish. Now navigate to unbound rules, click on new rule, click on port and then next. Here select UDP and write the exact numbers as me, 87662701697002700 and click on next. Make sure allow the connection is selected, here all the boxes must be checked, in this field create whatever name you like and click on finish. After that, feel free to close the window and start the server by double clicking on the file called Star Sons of the Forest Dedicated. Now let's try to connect to the server. Launch Sons of the Forest on your PC. Then click on Multiplayer and press on Join. Now you will need to change your server option to Dedicated right here on the left. Now in this filter tab, you can search for a server by typing its name. After that, your server should now show up, so simply navigate your mouse to your server and press on Join. And as you can see, you have now successfully connected to your own Sons of the Forest server. Enjoy! That's it for today. If you have any questions, you can contact our support by creating a ticket on our website or live chat and we will be more than happy to help you out. Now, have a lovely rest of the week and enjoy playing on your Zap server.